okay so i hope this video will help uh, so in your srm email id you might have got this uh, this uh, wi-fi email which is more relevant if we go offline and the next important thing is this one so basically what you need to do is that you have to click on this accept invitation okay so you will have your email id and as soon as you click it you will have a page where they will ask you to create a password and confirm it and then you just have to see your timetable you just need to know which badge you are b1 or b2 and then you have to just go up here and you will find the timetable of your respective batch and at first i didn't understand what the these a b c d e mean it means this okay so the slot uh, when you go to my timetable and attendance you will able to see that uh, your each course title has a slot code okay so don't get confused suppose uh, physics semiconductor is a and you will just have to go to your timetable again and you will find that it's in day one at the first slot okay and since every uh, now since another again don't get confused that when physics semiconductor is also as p17 and p18 then it's referring to the point when physics semiconductors is in these period uh, in seventh and eighth period okay so that's how the timing is referred and you can simply check these by switching to these two sections of the academic web service okay i hope this video helped uh thanks